Hey guys, what's up? It's Dean here, one of the four co-founders of Discover Real. I want to share to you there a little bit about the interface and our philosophy around it and step you through the different um, portals or different ways you can access Discover Real and the importance of knowing that because we have a different culture and philosophy in the wording we use. So here's the main page. So basically what this is is Right now, this is a brand reel. So, so the main concept of a reel is just this layout, this interface. So this is a brand wheel, for instance. So here are the team members. Here's a little bit about Discover Reel. And right now, we're running a bit of a crowdfunding kind of situation. And here are just videos of updaters of our product and journey updates. So think of this more like from a SaaS perspective of... Um, launching something and as a crowdfunding type of situation. So we want to keep updated with people that are supporting us, following us, and these are the videos doing that. Another thing we have is a little bit different, is a store. So most brand reels will have a store, so you can put products online. If your uh, company is a product-based company, then merchandise stuff, anything you put on Amazon, it can go here. And I'll just go to a world. Okay, so this is a reel. This is on our homepage at the moment, but this will be its own reel in the future. So discoverreel.com forward slash reels forward slash discoverreel. And there'll be brand reels, there'll be personal reels, which each one of these here will have their own personal reels. So I'll just go skip a bit from reels to worlds. And so we'll start with uh, esports. Esports is one of Franco's favorite um, at the moment. So we started to build this. So the main concept of a world is think of this like an online magazine, right? And the beauty with this is, is a visual way to curate content into columns. So here we've got our first column. So there's videos. So there's one video here. You click on it and it plays. The internet's a bit slow here, guys, but it plays. It's slow today. Okay, and then anything related, so renowned in this industry, so any people renowned in this industry, we call them athletes in this, this world. So this is a world. So a world is anything on Wikipedia, a term, a topic, a word, a person, anything. So, a world can be anything, and there'll be worlds will open up gradually. So anyone that's inspired about a world, really inspired by esports, they'll curate, they'll collect content on here, and we'll curate it. So the beauty in this is, at the moment, we have a manual way to collect content. So if you find anything on the internet, on the a URL, yeah, any content, you can add it to these columns. And you go through the process of this. So, for instance, we're in the people column. So we'll add a person. So in this case, we'll, we could put XQC, this guy, that's his player's name. So if he's in Wikipedia, you can put it there. And if not, he's, he has to have a verified Twitter account. So at this stage, we're curating very verified content. Not anyone can put, like, I cannot put my... If I'm not on Wikipedia or I have verified Twitter account, I cannot put my, my, myself on, on a world at this point. It might be a paid feature in the future. And then we'll go through and choose his role. So is he a scientist? Is he an artist, entrepreneur? Is he a gamer? And then we'll click on this. Okay, so well relevant list. So why, why is this person? He's renowned in his industrial field. He's a member of the, a band, company, team. He's a current participant, etc. And then we'll go into tagging. So tagging is like these worlds again. So you can tag any, anything in Wikipedia. So right now there's only a few worlds. There's up about 10 of them. You can tag those so the content shows up in also those worlds. So if it's related. So for instance, gaming. There might be a game to do with um, Fortnite, another game. And Fortnite may be on Wikipedia. So this content, this video or this article or this person can be related also to that world. So we show up in that world. And then we get your email address. So this is a, this is a very public version of Discover Reel. So think of this as magazine for a magazine for every world out there. 
So you can do that also for startups. So this is organization column. So right now this is startups and esports startups. So then you can add content. So these are all the startups related to esports. Then articles will come. So the beauty in this is, is from this point of view, think of all the worlds, the worlds that we created that are all terms, topics, and words, or people in Wikipedia. These will be displayed public, and anyone can add to them. At this point, it'll be manual, and you have to sign up. But as soon as you sign in over here into your discovery or profile, or real, as we call it, um, you'll be able to see all this content aligned to you. So when you go here, it won't be line, aligned on um, the time it was added chronologically, but it'll be added based upon alignment. And alignment will go into the next video. But yeah, so that's a basic introduction to worlds and brand reels. Thanks, guys.